hello friends welcome back to my channel today i am in front of you all with a very important topic that in today's world women face so is the harassment the cyber stalking or the cyber harassment that a woman faces on the online platform so today i am going to talk about the different kinds of harassments those are taking place on regular basis with women so also we'll try to find out certain laws through which women can get benefit of those online threats and abuses that usually occur with women so welcome back to my channel i am advocate moshumi chatterji and you all know me that i talk in favor for the benefit of men and women and i am very much gender neutral in this regard so i am not at all biased and in this regard i would like to talk about uh, my personal experience where i myself have found that there are many abusers on online platform who try to demean you whatever you post yes there is a freedom of speech and expression uh, given guaranteed by our constitution but still you don't have the right to uh, either stalk online uh, on somebody and especially a woman so let us see what are the different uh, kinds of uh, different kinds of abuses those are there so number one is cyber stalking then i have made a list so i'm just trying to uh, look into my book and i just tell you this is the anonymous threat and blackmailing this is another kind of an abuse and harassment that take place online then another is abusive language use of abusive language and photoshop so this is one of the major kind actually they use abusive language in order to demoralize you and kind of uh, uh, let uh, Uh, kind of it's a defamation kind of a thing which actually defames your personality and your image on online platform then there is identity threat impersonation then uh, posting of obscene materials and uh, sexual harassment then there is insulting your religion then account takeover or unauthorized access of your online social media profile so uh, these are few uh, list those i have made which are there uh, on the which are there that the online abusers they actually try to use against you to target you and to defame you so now what are the things that you can do or what are the provisions are there under the indian legal system where you can uh, guarantee yourself a safer uh, place so uh, there are few sections which i would like to uh, inform you that under section 72a of the information and technology act you can file a case where there is a punishment uh, of uh, at least 3 years punishment of 3 years or with fine or uh, that may be extended to 5 lakh of rupees and uh, it may be with both and other sections like uh, the article the section 66a that has been uh, taken struck down by the supreme court uh, which is against the right to freedom of speech and expression uh, this uh, has given uh, most of the abusers a very good chance to actually come and threaten you online especially women folk who are very much active on online Uh, platform so uh, there are other uh, sections under the indian penal code under which you can take action is that there are sections uh, such as 100 uh, 507 of ipc 354a of ipc 354c of ipc 354d of ipc and so forth uh, we can uh, the list is long so there are many sections so in order uh, and the my purpose of making this video to somehow make you aware of the situation that you are not alone as a woman you are not alone that you are being abused or you uh, should keep quiet or stay mum regarding this because there are many institutions on which you can go and file your complaint so one is you can go to the police station or you can file a case uh, on the 
cyber uh, link which is a government link and uh, you can also go to the national commission for women or state commission for women or you can file under the posh uh, committee uh, where which is under this uh, prevention of the sexual harassment act uh, the committee that has been formed so, so these are the platforms where you can go and uh, seek help uh, for yourself so uh, many things are that the women are also not themselves aware of so they are being demoralized and try they are somehow made to uh, go to the back foot and uh, many women are there in today's world who are earning on the basis of this online platform they're having a good uh, job they are be, they uh, try to uh, express themselves on online or social media but they are somehow harassed and they are being demoralized so these are the provisions and the places where you can go and put your complaint and these are the legal provisions which are I have told but before uh, if you find my video to some help I will also like to suggest you that doing before doing something just on this particular on the basis of this particular video it would be better to go to an advocate who is expert in cyber law and take a, 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 a very good suggestion from the lawyer and then you go and file a suit because a lawyer will be able to a very perfect and an appropriate lawyer in this field will be able to guide you properly so this was a very initial video and a very small video which I have made for you hope you have liked this video and if you want to stay with me and want to help me out to come up with uh, good videos for you all please do like share and subscribe my channel and i'll be very happy to comment all the uh, answer all the comments which you post there very decently thank you very much for watching my channel so see you in my next video